السلام علیکم دس از اے کمپیوٹر سائنس ٹیچر سر فوار اختر انصاری وی اسٹارٹ آر ٹاسک اوکے وی ہیو ڈن ٹاسک ون ٹاسک ٹو سکسیزفلی اینڈ نو از اے ٹاسک تھری ان ٹاسک تھری واٹ وی ہیو ٹو ڈو انشیور ایچ بکنگ از دا بیسٹ ویلو اینڈ وی ہیو ٹو فائنڈ اینڈ آفر دیٹ واٹ اٹ ووڈ بی دا economical value for the people for example buying two family ticket is better than a group of ticket for a group of 10 that must include adult and the children like let's suppose if i uh, if i'm going with my friends like six or seven friends and uh, we are going in the group and uh, our ticket cost is according to the this value like let's suppose the box is present in our community and if uh, the people if the group of people includes children then we can offer them this package 16 for the entire family means it includes two adults and three children means five people so instead of buying individual ticket we can offer them a uh, family ticket but the requirement is that they must have children like it says that includes adults and the children so we can offer the best value to the users so a little review of task 3 that ensure each booking is the best value and we have to offer an economical ticket amount to our customer okay now we ended task 2 here and now for a task 3 for a task 3 i must first share about the declaration of variable that i told in my first video of the um web declaration of cd code okay now i will share this document with all of you you can see the link in my description box so you may download it and then i will also make video on its program that i created and i will also share the link of the video in my description so you may check the document and if you want to see how the program looks like in the vb.net then you may click the link in the description box you may uh, navigate to the automatic okay now variable declaration for task 3 what are the variables following variables are used to calculate best value so best total cost best value and best value cost i have taken three variables for the task 3 best total cost best value and best value cost what what does it mean come on i share you okay now in task 3 okay <coughs> task 3 now calculate best value for day 1 okay so if day equals to 1 and ticket choice is 1 then we have to compare number of at If you look at here, that if one adult goes, he will pay twenty dollar. What about if a group of adults are going? So how they will pay? So we may consider them to offer ticket number five, which consists of fifteen dollar for the one person. So if number of adult greater than five, then we may multiply number of ordered adult with the fifteen. why we are offering 15 because if number of adult are more than 6 or 7 so we can offer them ticket number 5 and the cost is 15 dollar so that's why if number of adult greater than 5 then we can multiply number of adult with the 15 and then we will store in the variable best value cost now extra cost formula remains same for the day one and the best total cost how can we find by adding extra cost with the best value cost so we will see that best value cost best total cost has been calculated now we have to compare with the current cost so best value cost is greater than cost like let's suppose its total cost 200 right and best value cost is being calculated as 150 or 180 so our system will decide that if best value cost is less than current cost then it will suggest a user to buy a group ticket it would be an economical for you 
kindly press Y for yes and it will be stored in the best value. The best value is basically storing the character Y, capital Y or the small Y. Okay, so if the uh, user press capital Y or small Y, then what would happen? Our system will print, uh, print means display the cost of ticket and after that it will show the value. And now we close this, these condition statements with the couple of items. So there are four ifs and then that's why we use four items. Now cal uh, calculate for the ticket cost three. If the ticket choice is three, okay, what is a three senior? So what about if one senior is going, he will pay sixteen dollar. If he is go going with the uh, six or seven or eight people, so we will offer him ticket number five. So same formula will be applied here. Number of senior greater than five, then best value cost can be calculated by multiplying number of senior into fifteen. Then extra cost we have taken out, then we will calculate total cost by adding extra cost and the value cost we will see best total cost is in this form and same that we did in the last uh, part that best total cost is less than total cost then it will display a message by a group ticket it would be canonical for you kindly you press y for yes and if best value equals to y or a small y then the cost of ticket is the best total cost so if you can see that the process has been repeated now we close our image ok now for the next calculate best value for the date same thing the only difference is else if d equals to 2 ticket choice is 1 number of adult 5 same thing the only difference is the price because for the day 2 it's 22.5 as you can see for the group ticket 22.5 so that's why we have taken here same formula same thing with the day 1 formula now everything is there okay. and, and the same thing with the number of senior greater than 5 then you can see the best value 22.5 you can see here total cost and the group of ticket so day one and day two has been calculated now input we will ask the user that do you want another booking and it will be stored in the variable user choice and then it will clear the screen if the user press y then of course the booking process will be repeated and if the user press n then capital n or small n then it will display a message input press any key to exit when we input then uh, our program will be shut down so this is end of the task 3 if you still don't understand you may go to my groups uh, O levels computer for the executive program or uh, and also you may visit my channel for the explanation of the code and the executive program so you may clear your concept so uh, I am also working on the version 2 of this code so if you don't understand you may check the description box for the links thank you so much I hope you understand you are